Welcome back, Flamingos. I'm going to cover today Universal Studios in Orlando, Florida, Mardi Gras food. Hey, Flamingos, help me out. This year, I'm trying to reach 1,000 subscribers, so please subscribe. So on Thursday, February the 9th, we went to Mardi Gras in Universal Studios. Here are some of the first things we tried, the blackened chicken po' boy and the shrimp gumbo with rice. Both were excellent with a moderate spice level. I highly recommend both. The next booth, we tried the carnitas arrapas. These were excellent. Um, I hadn't had one quite like this before, but it was very tasty. I recommend it. Here at the next food booth, we tried the shrimp and avocado ceviche and the sweet corn johnny cake. Um, both were very good. Both were very tasty. I do want to give you a heads up though. The sorbet on the shrimp plate, uh, while it was all good together, it was a little strange eating a sorbet with all those savory things, but overall it was well executed. Next up, we did the conch fritters and the buttermilk lemon blueberry shortcake. The conch fritters were excellent. Uh, we really enjoy conch fritters. These were cooked really well. The pineapple edition was very nice. The, um, the blueberry dessert, um, while I love blueberries, I did not notice the lemon that they said was there um, and the biscuit was extremely dry, making um, this dessert very hard to eat. Um, I would say this would be a hard pass for me for next time. I would not get it again. Next up was the Creo Crab Beignets. Um, I love crab cakes. I love beignets and therefore I thought these two together were going to be excellent. However, I am very sad to report that it was not excellent. Um, I'm not sure what the funkiness was about it, um, but it was not well executed. Um, I do not recommend this. I highly recommend that you spend your money on something else. Um, me and my husband both tried these and we couldn't eat them. Okay, here we tried the shrimp laska. I'm pretty sure I'm butchering that. And the rojimo. also think I'm butchering that. Um, but these were both very flavorful, well-executed, excellent dishes. Uh, so the one is basically like a ramen dish, traditional with the egg and, and stuff. It was, it was so good. Um, that was our favorite from this booth. Um, and the other one, um, while it was absolutely delicious, it was a little difficult to eat, but worth it just the same. Here I tried the uh, Romeo and Juliet um, dessert. It was excellent. Um, I love uh, fried cheese with a fruit and sugar dusted donut type whole they were excellent. I would totally eat a whole bucket of those. The last thing we tried was out of the Tribute Store confectionery box. This was a um, bourbon macaroon. Um, the girl behind the counter sold it hard with being um, heavy on the bourbon flavor. We didn't notice heavy bourbon flavor in ours. It was good. Um, it was a well-executed macaroon. Um, not my favorite. Would probably not get it again. So that's a quick review of some of the food that we tried while we were at Mardi Gras. There were several other booths that we did not try. Um, we may or may not get around to those, but um, most of those were the basic love fan favorites, um, like the shrimp boil, which is always excellent. I can't think of any place that I've ever had one that it was bad. Um, beignets, those kinds of things, um, fan favorites. So I did want to give y'all a review of some of the things I tried and hope to help you out on your next trip. Well, until next time, shake a tail feather.